G'day all, today is St Florian's Day, International Day of Firefighters. It is a time when we honour the personal sacrifices made by our firefighters, their families and their colleagues. This year, tragedy has hit close to home amongst our first responders. Only last week, we grieved in sorrow and solidarity amongst our Victoria Police brothers and sisters in blue. This follows a fire season in Australia where every state felt the full force of bushfire and tragically, nine firefighters lost their lives. This included three international visitors from the US. Although construction of the Victorian Emergency Services Memorial in Melbourne's Treasury Gardens is complete, the current coronavirus restrictions mean that an official opening is still some time away. The time will come for us to visit and see the memorial in person and next year and beyond we'll be able to host the annual CFA State Memorial service at that particular site. I know the importance of our annual State Memorial service for our members and their families, both past and present. The service itself provides us with a time to recognise and reflect on our CFA community and in particular those that have lost a family member or a friend in the line of duty. We will remember 2020 as one of the toughest year Victorians has faced. However, 2020 also marks the 75th anniversary of CFA. Is it important to reflect on how we have evolved as an organisation over this period of time? How our history, our experience and our united purpose has helped us prepare for major fire events like the season we have just experienced. CFA continues to adapt to the new environment to maintain the health of our staff and our volunteers while continuing to deliver the same vital service that protects life and property. But we never forget. We know that regardless of time, the memories, love and respect we have for all our fallen firefighters will remain with us forever. Thank you.